Okay. Okay. Yeah. So uh, me and Gerald met in 2010, uh, the first whenever we first started the Amina project here, and um, it was, you know, it was the, his first shot at an exoskeleton and uh, my first introduction to any kind of technology like this. So we um, we got started on the project, and whenever I came in, the design process was already done. So we already had an exo to work with, and I was essentially just testing. So Gerald was hands on the whole time. Me and him were face to face working together getting me in the XO, out of the XO, and like I was still getting used to the wheelchair. So me and him really kind of learned a lot about each other and learned, you know, and me about myself through the process going with the XO, different what standing up kind of changes in me. After after probably a month or so, you know, we're we're working, you know, on the XO, doing some testing and stuff. And me and Gerald have been working really hard and he he made this promise to me. He's like, dude, we were having some issues. And he looked at me just like he always does. He's like, dude, He's like, dude, I promise you, I will make you walk. And like he had this like determination, you know, in his face whenever he said it, you know. And so we, you know, we finished up the testing for that round and, um, and um, you know, and, and Gerald, you know, basically we run out of funding for the project. And Gerald kind of for the past, you know, seven, eight years now, he's been looking for a way to fund the EXO project. And, um, you know, with developing his own career, he's basically come into where he's flipping houses now and in in setting up the business so that he could remodel the houses and everything, he's basically providing an income for himself so he doesn't have to rely on sponsors to fund research that he wants to do, which is basically fulfilling his promise to me. Like he called me up and he was like, dude, I finally got a way, you know, to make money to where I can afford to do this. And he's, you know, he's dedicated. He wants to, he wants to fulfill that promise, you know, back in 2010 where he's like, I'm going to make you walk again. And, you know, he said it to me right out there. And I think that's that's the ultimate goal is, you know, he wants to build a business to provide an income so that he can fix my problem. And I mean, we've known each other for a really long time and we've stayed in contact over all these years. And it just it really amazes me that like that he thinks of he thinks of me like that, you know, and, and it's really cool to have, you know, you know, a friend of mine with that ability and, and the willingness to kind of like this is kind of his life project now and it's really neat to be you know to be able to help him with that in the long run it's it's exciting to see it come together and you know hopefully the funding process works and you know soon enough i'll be out of the chair and walking around for good <laughs>